no, that one's for real. That one's actually pretty dang decent. <laughs> Ooh, there's a lot of weight there. He ain't doing much yet. He pulled some heavy drag too for a second. Wow. Real fish. River Rats, it is absolutely gorgeous out here. The weather's great, the scenery's great. Company's questionable, but uh, I'm pretty optimistic that, you know, everything's gonna line up and we're gonna find some fish, and with any luck, we're gonna find some really big fish. So let's go. So the plan was to cover some water, and we made it like half a mile, and I'm like, oh, that spot looks good, that spot <laughs> looks good. <laughs> So uh, we didn't make it very far is the moral of that story. Also forgot the extension cord for the generator. So we are anchoring old school style. Like, I don't know, it's kind of weird. Putting the anchor in isn't the big deal. Pulling the anchor up, that's the, the thing that gets you. Thankfully you're here for that. Yeah. yeah. Wouldn't want you to get soft in your old no, age. No, you know? yeah. All right, we got plenty of shad. Hopefully not enough. It'd be cool if we caught so many fish we ran out, but we will see. And big baits do mean big fish, except when they don't. So we're gonna mix it up with a lot of different ones. You hear plenty of stories about guys catching 100 pounders on baits like that big, you know, and we have baits about that big. We'll mix it in with some bigger ones too. I think I'm gonna move my bait rag over here, away from your clothes. <laughs> I think it'd be more functional over here anyway. Oh, perfect. And I always put rattles on just to mix it up. I don't, sometimes they seem to make a difference, sometimes they don't, but. Got about half of them with rattles, half of them without rattles. We're gonna try a bunch of different stuff. Sure would be cool to just start off with a, like an 80. I'd take a 40. 80 would be cool, but I'd take a 40. I mean, if we're gonna dream, if I'm gonna dream, I'm gonna dream big, yeah. I think that's in the brush. We're probably gonna lose some tackle, and if we don't, we're not set up in the spot we need to be. So we'll note that. As many fish as were down there, I was really hopeful that we'd get a bite before I got all the rods out. <laughs> This weather, man, it's tough to beat. Yes, <laughs> just right. It's almost criminal. Like it should, this is almost too nice. And if we caught fish to go along with it, oh my. Yeah, we got an old school anchor because uh, I forgot the extension cord for the generator. So the generator is essentially worthless. I knew I'd forget something. We'll use the trolley motor more when we start getting into some really deep stuff. We're gonna fish some 70, 80, 90, probably 100 foot of water. Unless we beat them up down here, and that'd make it hard to leave. We'll see. We'll give this 20 minutes and we'll make one more move on this, and then if we don't get them at either of those spots, we're on the road. Well, we got a nibble, I think. On five, it bounced once. Like perhaps the flathead bounce. That was, I still can't believe we caught three flatheads like that yesterday. Might be about to get another one. Or turtle. <laughs> You're up if it goes down. Don't move the boat too much. You gonna do it? Get him? I don't know. Got him? Yep, you got him. Yeah, he's on there. 
Does, does he feel substantial? I mean, he doesn't feel like... I can't like get over how slow he pulled it down. I'll get the net. <sighs> you do or don't? I do. Oh, good. Yeah, the save. He's pulling a little bit of drag. The, I mean, I tighten them drags up a little bit too. Oh, good timing too. We got the barge coming. <laughs> I think this is a flathead. Cause he ain't I mean, the way he pulled it down, it's kind of flathead-ish. Oh yeah, that's a flathead. Ugh. Oh, he just got in it. Oh, no. Not even a bad one. You have such high standards for a guy who's got like 10 flatheads. I just, I don't know if he's bigger than my biggest, but I'll take him for sure. Okay, how's it wrapped? What's the chance we can get this untangled? Oh, now it's around the sinker. Oh, one more, one more, one more. Uh, maybe, maybe one more. Under, under. There we go. Yep. I'm kind of proud of myself right there. I don't think he may be over We'll know more when he gets closer. I like how we're starting the trip. That's yeah. all I know. You want to get him back there? Or? I can get him back there. Okay. I would say step back a little bit so I can step forward. Oh, yeah, he's nice. Oh, yeah. Get in there, buddy. First fish of the day. And he's a good one. Yes. Oh, he's way over 20. Yeah, <laughs> he's pretty nice. <laughs> he's way over 22. Oh. We might have another one going. Yep. 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 <laughs> uh, yeah, you might want to make room in that net. <laughs> I think you're going to have me beat, but he ain't bad. Uh, he's growing a little bit. Yeah, he's not tiny, tiny. Yeah, these were bombed out there a good long ways. Yeah, I thought, yeah, I right. Is he gonna go over it? Did he go over it? Yeah, he's, he might be a twin to yours. He's getting roly poly. Are we gonna have a blue? I'm not sure. I just know he got a bite and it's nice and hopefully we don't get ran over by barge yeah he's a blue he's got a fork tail i'll bring him over here we'll make life a little easier on ourselves but he ain't bad either all right i'm gonna let him swim forward and i'm gonna pop him up right next to you right there we got him. <laughs> Might as well start with the double. 20, less than 20 minutes. In. Yeah. Right now it's been 22 minutes. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> I'd trade you. <laughs> no. I'll stick with mine. I don't know. 20 minutes in. It's a good start. And, uh, this might work out good. We'll hang out down here, catch some really nice fish, and then go hunt for a monster, maybe. I don't know, although they say you shouldn't leave fish to find fish. That's true. All right, I'm gonna get mine back. I'm gonna get a picture of Chris's, and I think we're okay on the barge. All right, see ya, bud. He ain't honking at us. Your biggest flyhead ever? Yep. Good day. Be cool if we could hop spots and just keep doing that. That would be really cool. Yeah. I suggest the weather and water conditions and all that, man. It's like 
It, it lines up good. Didn't want to get my hopes up, but that's a good start. Apparently the catfish missed a memo that they're supposed to be a barge bite. Where they they bit before the barge got here. There you go. Lincoln yeah. Stenson was a, a, a uh, early barge bite. Yeah. Premature. Yeah, they're premature barge bite. It's your 75 pound flathead dinking with it over there. <laughs> I mean, you can go give it a try, I guess. You want them? I mean, if you're going to be all, it needs some more enthusiasm if you're going to reel it in. Yeah! <laughs> See, he lacked your lack of excitement, and they said, you know what? Forget that guy. I'm out of here. Or maybe not. Maybe he's still there. I think he's still there. You know, he's still there. So you seem to be moving him no problem. <laughs> I like how we got a streak going though, two spots, yeah. two fish. Oh, they come off? We definitely could have. Those small ones, it's tough to keep them on the hook. Those was even the small baits. I really don't want to end our streak. Our streak of one. <laughs> <laughs> It's looking like we're going to have to restart her because you couldn't get that monster to the boat. That was not a monster. <laughs> that. Is this bass boat going to run us over? He did not see us. He just veered out of the way right there. I think that's a good sign for us to get rolling. I'm glad he saw us eventually, though. <laughs> He jerked that way. Yeah, he did. <laughs> well, I mean, we're pretty camouflaged. Yeah, a little boat. Yeah, I think we're going to go for a little bit of a ride and look at some stuff. We're in deep enough stuff right now where I don't think I have enough anchor rope, so we're gonna spot lock. And we marked a bunch of fish and they are definitely out of the current. They might not be actively eating. But we're gonna throw a bait at them to see. I called you and I got a bite. <laughs> Get him. No way. Yeah. Oh, he popped it out of his mouth. <laughs> so I'm the last resort? No. You're just using me? I'm not just using you this time. <laughs> That's two now. That you missed. <laughs> That means I'm up two times in a row now. Go for it. <laughs> I was really hoping there'd be more fight out of you than that. A little disappointed right now. Even more disappointed in your lack of fight than I am about you missing two fish in a row. <laughs> Chris is sleeping, so that's the sign that the fishing has slowed down. Or wait, wait. Were you just resting your eyes? I was a little cat <laughs> This habitat type, I don't think, is conducive to big fish. 
Well, that little bass boat is scooting. And they're loving, they're living their best life over there. We found a spot that is 112 feet deep in the deepest spot. Uh, we are looking around in more of that 80 to a 90 range with a bunch of structure, mainly because we didn't mark anything in the 110. I really don't have a ton of confidence just because the water is up and full of junk, but I have to fish it. It's falling a long ways. Seven days later. <laughs> it's on the bottom. So far, I'm staying there even. That's nuts. We got a nibble. It would be so cool to catch one out of water this deep. I'm sure some people do it routinely, but I do not. I come from the land of, oh my gosh, it's eight feet deep. It's so deep. 100 feet of water is 100 feet of no fish. Like, uh... oh, that one popped out, sweet. We're gonna go look for shallower, greener pastures with more trees eventually, because it's gonna take us forever to reel these in. Yeah, I went to school in Muskogee for two years. Oh, he's back. Not, uh, I suppose I'll get him now. Oh, he dropped it. He's persistent, I'll give him that. If he came back once, he'll probably come back again. Is he committed this time though? You gonna do it? I think he just dropped it again. <laughs> After a day of you know, a large chunk of our day not having very many bites, that gets me kind of excited. Yup, that one's for real. That one's actually pretty dang decent. <laughs> uh, there's a lot of weight there. He ain't doing much yet. Yeah, that's just a lot of weight. He pulled some heavy drag too for a second. Real fish. We might have to do a couple anchor spots on this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nice one. Easy there, buddy. He's still a long ways down there. There's a lot of trees and rocks. Yeah, he's just staying down, which makes me think he's really big. It looks like a good one from <laughs> I think so. Gonna try and take it easy with him because he is coming up off the bottom. Hopefully, I can keep him out of all the lines and the drift sock and whatnot. Where are you going, dude? See the bubbles coming up way down there. Oh, there he was. And he's not as big as I thought he was, but he's pretty. He's pretty dang nice. I had images of a hundred pounder in my head for a second. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna go quite that big, but 
He's pretty big. Oh yeah. He ain't bad. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, swing him up over here, and I'm gonna pop him up right next to the boat. Hopefully. Here he comes. Get that head in there. Yep, yep. Bad a boy. Nice net job. That was a full body net job. <laughs> He's not so easy to lift in the boat. <laughs> That's a good one there. Oh, oh he's grown quite a bit. Yeah. Hell yeah. That's over 50 easy. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> nice. Tell you what, this fish is going to make me take my sweatshirt off. That's what he's going to do. I'm kind of warm now. Oh, wow. He's going to be about 70. Right. Yeah, 70. <laughs> I'm going to get slimy. I'm just accepting it right now. Yeah. Easy kill. Yeah, 70 pounder. <laughs> we uh, caught some fish right away, then we had the afternoon doldrums, and then got woke up and warmed up really fast with this dude right here. Um, oh, he's not too happy with me holding him. It's not very light either. But uh, I'm gonna get a few pictures of him, and then I'm gonna put him back in the water. You see how slimy my camera is? I'm sure I'm pretty slimy too. All right, I'm gonna get back in. Okay, buddy. He should be good to go. He burped up a bunch of bubbles on the way out. These jaws that open up. There we go. Okay. That was neat. <laughs> oh. Thank you. I think that's better. I think that's also a good point to end the video. I don't think of a, I can't think of a better send off than a 70 pounder, but. Man, I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. I'd be pretty impressed if, if that's the case, but I don't know. I'm just saying dumb because uh, <laughs> caught a big fish. Oh, we're about to get another one. Anyway, thanks for watching. Appreciate the heck out of it. If you liked it, hit the like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. I'm going to quit rambling because I'm jacked up saying dumb stuff. Hope you catch a giant. Mm -hmm.